double click Design Pro. Every Design Pro's welcome screen has four choices step by step wizard, pre designed template, design from scratch, open existing project. All four choices follow a different path to the main work screen. Let's create the same business card using different paths. First, the step-by-step -step wizard. Click Next, enter 8371. Click Next, select a design often referred to as a template. Click Next. To edit an individual business card, use the Click the Panel to Edit. To edit the text, use Click the Item to Edit. Let's change the name in the fifth panel to Remington Steel. Remington Steel. Click Finish. Click Print and Preview. Exiting the, again, exiting the wizard allows you to edit, print, and save your project within the Design Pro work area. You will not be able to edit this project further using the wizard. Click OK to continue. Let's bump the zoom up to 200%. And notice on our fifth panel, and all panels after, the name has been changed to Remington Steel. Now you can print or click close to further edit. Click close, and now you're in the main work screen of Design Pro. Let's start over and use the pre-designed template path. Click X and click No. Click the Welcome Screen icon. Now click the pre-designed template. Here you see under business cards, glossy white is open. Select this template and click OK. Again, you're in the main work screen of Design Pro. In the next video, I'll cover the tools available for editing in this screen. Again, in the next video, I'll cover the tools available for editing in this screen. Click X and No and the Welcome screen. The Open Existing Project is only useful if you have saved your work. I'll show you how to do so later. This leaves Design from Scratch. Click on Design from Scratch. This is the path I always take because it's the most straightforward and flexible. You'll see what I mean. Enter 8371 and click OK.
reduce the zoom to 200%. Again, you're in the main work screen of Design Pro. Let's go back to the welcome screen again. I want to point out none of the tools shown work until you land on the main work screen of Design Pro. You can't even close Design Pro by clicking on X. You must first click Cancel, which is dimly lit, and then click X. In the next video, I'll cover the tools available for editing the main work screen.